Hello students, let us start with the next module. In this module, we discuss differentiation of parametric function. Let us start with the question. U is equal to 2BT upon 1 plus T square. V is equal to A1 minus T square upon 1 plus T square. We need to show du by dv is minus b square v upon a square u. A very important problem my friends from exam point of view. A very important one. Let us start with u. u is equal to 2bt upon 1 plus t square. b is a constant so it can be taken outside. It is 2t upon 1 plus t square which is nothing a compound angle formula of 2 tan theta upon 1 plus tan square theta and 2 tan theta upon 1 plus tan square theta is nothing but sine 2 theta. So let us substitute T as tan Q. If I substitute T as tan Q, what we are left with? U is equal to B 2 tan Q upon 1 plus tan square Q. What is 2 tan q upon 1 plus tan square q? Which is nothing but sine 2q. So u is equal to b sine 2q. Let us differentiate with respect to q. du by dq. b constant. Sine 2q. Is it a standard or a composite? I say it as composite. To which standard form? Sine x. What is derivative of sin x? Cos x. Or here it will be cos 2q. What is replacing big X? 2q. Differentiate it. 2. Let us write v. What is v? A into 1 minus t square upon 1 plus t square. Which compound angle formula it looks like? 1 minus tan square theta upon 1 plus tan square theta which is nothing but cos 2 theta. So let us substitute T as tan Q. If I substitute T as tan Q, what I will get? V is equal to A 1 minus tan square Q upon 1 plus tan square Q. What is 1 minus tan square Q upon 1 plus tan square Q? It is nothing but cos 2Q. So let us substitute V as A cos 2Q. If I differentiate with respect to Q, derivative of V will be dV by dQ. A constant, cos 2Q, is it a standard or a composite? I say it as composite. To which standard form? Cos x. Derivative of cos x, minus sin x. Over here I will get it as minus sin 2Q. What is replacing big X? 2Q. And derivative of 2Q with respect to Q is nothing but 2 du by dv in parametric function is nothing but du by d theta upon dv by d theta. Over here it will be du by dq upon dv by dq. If I substitute it, I'll get it as 2b cos 2q upon minus 2a sin 2q. Cos 2q from step number third, can I write it as v by sin 2q from step number Second, can I write it as u by v? So I'll get it as du by dv is equal to minus b by a. Cos 2q is nothing but v by a. Sin 2q is nothing but u by b from first and third. So du by dv is nothing but minus b square v upon a square u as required. 